Hi, I'm Charlotte Crosby and I'm going to be taking a little walk down memory lane to look at my fashion choices over the years. I, my hairstyle at that time was the beehive. It was a little bit Amy Winehouse. I didn't have any eyebrows. I didn't have any lip. I don't even think it really looks like I've got any eyes there either. My whole face is kind of being swallowed by my big chubby cheeks. I just don't really like the way I look there. I look a little bit like a beetroot. This one I don't really have a problem with. That is just standard casual wear, pair of joggers and a hoodie. I still wear that to this day. However, it's more the appearance again. <laughs> like the brown hair, I don't like. I don't want to be brown again. Because it looks like I don't have eyebrows, it looks like my forehead is just even bigger. Because <laughs> there's nothing breaking up the space between the lid and the, and the hairline. I'm so glad I got them eyebrows tattooed on. <laughs> This one isn't bad because I've got a full face of makeup on and my eyebrows have been drawn in and my lips have probably been drawn in. My hair's long, I've got a nice little red dress on. This one is a pass. A skimpy black dress with a high split. You can't go wrong. I am starting to think that my fashion sense wasn't really that bad. It was just what I always did with my hair. So if you look, my hair is like really, really, really big, like almost touching the sky. So I think that was a big no-no. The fashion is fine. The hair, blonde, good. Touching the skies, not so good. This one is so wrong and I'll tell you why. I had a boyfriend at this time called Mitch and we were really comfortable with each other so I started to gain a little bit of weight. I started to not care what I really looked like. This picture is from the night I went into Big Brother and it was meant to be such a big night. I should have been making such an effort. When I look at people walking into Big Brother these days, they look pot on, they look, they've just walked off the catwalk. I'm wearing a kilt. I don't know what the hell's going on. I'm not even wearing high heels, I remember. I had some little boots on, some ankle boots. Because I was so self-conscious in the way I looked, I just stopped caring and just tried to hide my figure because I wasn't happy at that time. This one is nice. It's around Christmas time. I've got a little black skirt on, Christmas jumper, some over-the-knee boots. Fashion-wise, I'm, I'm good. I'm winning. Hair is a little too curly, but at least it's not massive. What on earth was I thinking? <laughs> I just can't, I've got no words for that. That's, that was a bad stage of my life. I think that was the Mitch stage again. <laughs> this one isn't so bad. This was the, also the Mitch stage, but I think I was maybe on the weight loss journey and I, and I was starting to get myself back and um, making an effort. And I've, have, I've made a little effort there. I think that's actually quite nice. This is a good one. Gorgeous little classy dress, beaded, navy, nothing too revealing, nice updo with the hair. I think I was about eight stone ten there. I can't even like imagine being that weight again. Mm, all wrong, I think. This is another red carpet appearance, but I had the brown hair and I don't think this dress was right for my humongous tits, so I'm gonna give this a no. This is trendy, trendy Wendy, very trendy, very trendy. Cool, this is very cool. I'm giving it some boho chic. I've got a little pair of sunglasses on. My tan is on fleek. This is a winner. 